Hi guys, it's me Hee. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video is going to be Netflix recommendations to watch on Netflix. So we're going to talk about movies, TV shows, and just stuff to watch when you're bored in quarantine and just what to watch on Netflix. Who doesn't want that? So let's just get into this video, but before we do this, don't forget to subscribe down below and give a big like to this video. So yeah, let's just get started. Alright, so the first section and general that I have is um, horror TV shows or like horror and thriller shows is the American Horror Story TV show. It's pretty much an anthology horror drama series and it talks about each season is um, a different category. So the, for example, the first season talks about this family of three, three that move into this, um, this horror house and pretty much it has a whole bunch of people who were murdered there and yeah it pretty much just like shows them getting haunted and i thought it was a great tv show and yeah you guys should watch that um the next tv show that i suggest is the walking dead it was based on a comic book series so it talk it's pretty much zombies and it talks about this guy rick who is the main character and he's pretty much a police officer and it shows him in in his life and then it shows like how he wakes up and then he finds out this world is full of zombies and like he goes to find his family and then it just goes on from there and then so the third um tv show that i recommend is called i zombie it's pretty much where this person named Liv Moore she attends this um party on like a yacht and she ends up getting turned into a zombie and she works inside um uh, a morgue and so it pretty much shows her life um working at the morgue and her being a zombie and it's pretty cool i really like this season and yeah another tv show is the bates motel that's a pretty good movie or tv show too um so going on to the movies i would like to suggest the amityville horror then the train to busan and then another one called secret obsession where um this person named jennifer wakes up with amnesia after an attack and pretty much her husband is caring for her but little does she know that it's really not her husband and he has a secret obsession over her pretty crazy so the next movie that I have is The Perfection where it's a troubled a musical prodigy and it just shows her her past and a, it's pretty crazy and yeah. So that's all the horror movie genre, TV shows and movies that I recommend. Okay, so onto the next genre is comedy. So the first TV show is Unbreakable Kimmy Smith. So it's pretty much um, Kimmy Smith who um, is rescued after 15 years from being kidnapped. And so she's trying to get back to her life. So she ends up moving to New York and it shows her life there. And she still kind of thinks that she's still a kid because after all these years, she hasn't been to um, social socialization and like being in a big community. So it just shows her life during then. The next TV show is The Good Place, where this main character named Eleanor, she faces the afterlife and it makes her think that she's in a heaven and she's in a really good place, but in reality, it's kind of not. So it's really funny and a really good show to watch. So the next um, show that I have is The Office. I'm not going to go into much detail with that because I know a lot of people watch The Office and you guys heard about it, so I just think um you guys should watch it i thought it's really funny so i have a few comedians that you guys should watch which is fluffy who is also gabriel i can't really say his last name but yeah and then the next person is joe joe coy he's a really funny comedian and yeah the um comedy tv show that i have or comedy um movie is the murder mystery it has adam sandler and it has um, jennifer adamson and so pretty much he's a new york cop and she wants to go on a vacation so he takes her on a vacation and then it pretty much shows like 
they're trying to solve this murder mystery and i thought it was really funny and it's really really cute i just really like that movie um another one is um it was made in 2005 it's called just friends so pretty much just high school student he's in love with his best friend but the best friend doesn't have feelings for him so it's like 10 years later like he ends up seeing her again and shows like his true colors and like what he's become and like it's really crazy i really love that movie and yeah okay so the next category i have is family tv show and movies the, the so the first tv show that i wanted to suggest is the series of unfortunate events it's a tv show but they also have the movie on netflix too but it's pretty much uh, a tragic tale of these orphans who are trying to investigate what happened to their parents and their parents were these spies and um and yeah they have this um evil guardian named count olaf and it tells their journey with him and yeah so the next tv show that i wanted to recommend is h2o um just out of water or just add water it's pretty much these three teenage girls who get stuck on this island and then they end up getting turned into mermaids and they pretty much go back to their regular lives but it's not regular anymore so i really love that tv show the next tv show that i recommend is the netflix tv show called cheer it's pretty much the navario cheerleaders showing their journey through their competition and it's pretty crazy and i really love that tv show and yeah you guys should watch that so um the family movies that I suggest is uh, Cinderella Story, The Corpse Bride, and then The Boy in the Stripes Pajamas. It's pretty much in World War II, this eight-year-old and his family in Berlin were taken to a concentration camp. And it's pretty crazy and I thought it would be very informal for the... Um, for kids or teenagers to see what it was like during that time and I thought it would be very informal and a very informational guide yeah and that movie made me cry and it was so sad it made me so emotional to see what life was like during that time all right so the next genre I have is teen movies on TV shows so the first TV show I have is Gilmore Girls the next one is Gossip Girl um, 13 Reasons Why, Stranger Things, and The Virgin River. So I wanted to explain The Virgin River because not a lot of people have heard about it. So it's pretty much a nurse practitioner who moves into this small little town and it shows her life. I think, I believe I heard it from someone else, but it's pretty much like the show called Heart Dixie. And yeah, I really like that TV show. So the movies that I have is Tall Girl to all the boys I loved before, Sleepover, which is um, this eighth grader going into high school. It's their summer where they have a slumber party and then they pretty much have a slumber party and they make all these cool events and it's really a good movie. And so the next movie that I have is Falling in Love. Then the last one that I have for this category is Someone Great. So it's pretty much this girl who's been dumped by her long-term boyfriend and her two best friends try to like um make her pretty much recover from this breakup and it's a really great movie so that's pretty much all that i have for um my teen movies so the other category i wanted to talk about it's not it's about pretty much like houses so the first one i have is amazing interiors i really like that movie that tv show and the next TV show that I have is Tiny House Nation, which is pretty much um, pretty much in the U.S. A lot of people make these tiny homes to pretty much live in. It's really small, it's really affordable, and it's really cool to see what these people's dreams are to be in a tiny house. And I really love watching those. Um, some honorable mentions are Jane the Virgin, which is pretty much a daughter of a teen mother, Jane Val oh my god i can't even talk but anyway she grew up um not wanting to be like her mom so it pretty much just shows her life and there's four seasons to that so it gets really interesting um then another movie that i wanted to suggest is what happened to monday and then last but not least hello my 20s okay thank you guys so much for watching this youtube video don't forget to like subscribe and comment down below what you guys want to see next 
Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye guys, have a great day.